everyone, I'm going to share with you how to make another project here. It's very easy. The fabric I have here, I have two. The wide side is 10 inch and the long is 12. So 10 by 12 and get two. And also I cut the interface. And the interface and I cut it smaller. Nine and a half by 11 and a half. So I'm going to go ahead and make sure everything is good. And then I'm going to flip into the right side, the fabric side. I usually iron on the fabric side. So after you iron the interfacing in here, you're going to place the second piece of fabric. So right side facing the right side, two inches are here so you can inside out. So go so all around. To here and stop leave this open everyone after i sold all around and i left in two or three inches it's up to you however you want to so take off the pen i've been using the pen because the project i do you cannot use the uh, clip cut the corners inside out Get the corners out after you get the corner out and in this this line right here you're gonna pull so it can be closed like this iron it and then you go on the top stick all around so go ahead and top stick all around those four sides here everyone after you top stick all around i'm having a yarn here i'm gonna cut about 15 inches or so when you have an extra you can drop it off you can use any color i'm just using this one right here with all different color around it so just get myself ready I just have to have this okay just fold it in half and get yourself ready so now you're gonna fold like a paper frame just keep going like this going up and down until you go on all the way Keep going, keep falling up, down, up, down, but make sure it's even like this, okay? And at the end, you make sure this one going down and this one going down, and that's all. Okay, now you have two of them, like this, you pinch right in the middle. I have this. And I'm going to go ahead and make the loop right here and I'm going to pull. In my mind, I use the red one because red look better on the blue and the yellow. So, just not to change, I just change, just go right in the middle and I just put that in there. I have the paste bay right there. I didn't sew anything in there yet. So, and I go ahead, tie this. that for now so I'm gonna go to here right in the center of this make sure everything good I'm gonna go to here and from this line right here I'm gonna go inside of this fun with the blue I'm gonna go in there so I can hide the knot 
I'm not there. There you go. So now I'm going to go ahead and sew. Okay, so now I'm going to go from here to there like this. Okay, so I'm going to go right right here, okay? Not on the sole line. This sole line, no. I'm going to go right to here. Because when you sew in here, I'll show you the fun. See that? If you sew up to here, then you're going to leave the space open. So it's more down. And then one more time. One more time it's right here that I'm gonna sew. Okay, let me see. All right, so go ahead and do like that, everyone. Run and stitch all the way to here. Just something like that. You can see it right here. Go all the way. Hand sew is better, so go ahead, run and stitch all the way down. So now after I sew on this straight line out to here, you see this one is sticking up. I like you to gently press this down so it can flap in down to this here. So when it flap into here, i show you. When it flap into here, you go to make sure it just go down a bit. You don't need to go down all the way, just like this. And then you go on to gently sew this little piece in. The season changed when the, oh, it did very well, the weather here in, in where I am. So go ahead and so I just sewed a little bit right here so it can light out. No, I don't need to sew a big thing. And then I just make a loop right here and then I come out just like that. Very easy. Awesome. Look at this. And then this side, you're going to do exact the same. You're going to make sure it go down to the side here. And go ahead to, I'm going to go in here first so I can fold. Go in here. Hide my thread. Go into this sole line right here. Sew it back in. Make a loop, sew it back in. You can make more if you want, it's like two or three times. And that's it for this. And then now we'll go down to touch up and we are done. Okay, so I have bead in here. I have the pearl that I got it from a Dollar Tree. So I get three sides, the big one and then the small and the smallest one. Okay, so the first one, I'm gonna get the big one go in. So I have a crochet hook right here leave it in there for now and then I'm going to pull one at a time because the, the crochet hook is small and the the yarn is a big big so I'm gonna do one yarn at a time to pull through this here okay when you get pull one you're gonna pull another one yeah do what you have to do I have patience, so I'm okay. <laughs> so I pull, so that will be right there. And then the next one, I'm using the pink. Now I do the same thing. Pull the first one and then the second, because two of them cannot go through with that hook. And if you get the bigger hook, it cannot go through the holes of the pearl. You know, one way or the other. It's just you have to work that out. Okay, and then do another one. Okay, so pull. Then I have two, and then last one. Ok, 
Okay, now I get three of them in here. And now I am all done. You see how cute that is? Instead of making the, uh, the, um, the paper fan, you can make from fabric. And this one, you can hang it up. It's for your decoration or you can use as the fan. So when you get into here, hold it right there at the end very tight. Turn it around and you're going to make a knot go right next to it. Okay. Turn this around, make a knot. Here you're gonna pull the knot. There you go. So you are good to go. Okay. You cut this off a little bit. You don't need to have a long tail. Cut this off in the same line of this. Okay, here we go everyone. So that is it for today. Easy project. You can use this after fan and you can fan yourself or oh my goodness it's too good okay or you can hang it up in the wall for your decoration isn't that so cute look at that look how cute this is and the back is yellow with the blue and the front is this stay safe and take care everyone thank you so much for watching i hope you make this i think this is cute i don't know about you but i think this is cute um, if it, I make many um, paper one, but with the paper I threw it away, and then every time I need it, I have to make a new one. So making something nice like this, I won't throw it away. That's the whole point of it. So so cute. Stay safe and take care, everyone. Thank you so much for watching.